Now we just got off the train at Osaka, or Shin Osaka as it's actually called. Yeah, heading down to the subway now. I'm trying to get a ticket out of the machine. We need to get the Midasuji line. When you go to the machine, it doesn't ask you like what station you're going to, it asks you how much you want to pay. There's a map up here above the machines where you buy a ticket and basically it's got a number next to it and that number is the amount that you need to pay for the ticket. Look for your station and then check what amount that relates to. I can't see our station on here. Oh, there it is. Dabutsu and May. Dabutsu and May is 290 for adults, 150 for children. So let's start by clicking English. 290. I want three adults. How do I change this to three adults? Let's try again. Let's try and book three. Ah, three. Oh, I've put too much in. Where's the tickets? Put them here. Oh. We have our tickets. I'm going to have my first ever Japan vending machine experience. I just need a Coke Zero. I really want one. It's really hot. I want this one. So 140 yen. And I assume I pop it into this little slot here. Okay, now I've just had a thought. I'm not sure if it is 140 or if that's the number for the code for the drink. I'm really confused actually how this works. Oh, it says it here. Insert coins or yen. Push a button to choose drink. Oh, the buttons are here. Oh, oh no, I pressed the wrong one. Oh, no, I don't want that. No, I don't want that. How do I stop? Okay, I think I've just reset it. Okay, good. <laughs> this one, Coke Zero. And then I enter the money in here. Oh, it's sold out. Oh, <gasps> no. This is not a very good first vending machine experience. Okay, that's why it didn't work. <laughs> I end up with a water and it's a very small water at that. But it's still a drink. I'm really hot. I'll drink anything right now. What did you get in the vending machine? Nothing. I got a water. Harry, what did you get? <laughs> What did you get, Harry? Sugary drink? Starts with an M. Monster! Just bought this chill out relaxation. It's all written in Japanese, so I have no idea what it is, but I'm gonna give it a try. It's freezing. Some sort of soda drink, I don't know. Hey, that's nice, that. I got a bit too excited there, drank too much. Yeah, I'm not really sure what it is. I don't think it's an energy drink because it's called Relax. I wish I could read it. Why'd it be an energy drink that says chill out? Yeah, it wouldn't be a real... Yeah, that's a good point. Chill out. Oh, but you don't think it sends you to sleep, do you? Well, oh, chill out, relaxation. It's got a lot of guys sleeping. Oh, it's in Japanese. We need to translate that, that quick. It could be a sleepy drink. It could be a sleepy drink and we're just taking... I've got to stay awake all night. But to be fair, I need to go to bed early on. No, no, I've got things to do. I can't be asleep. Right, it says... Relaxation drink. Chill and creative in a stressful society. It doesn't really give me much information on what it is, though. Gabba, Lee, Elfianine. An Indian. Oh no, the Indian's the name of the company actually. Shinsekai Market. That's where we are. There's a little store here that we've come across with some very interesting looking stuff. One of these or one of these? Yeah, I'm going to try that one. Do you want to share that? Let's try it. Oh, Me and Dan have got one to share. It's very. What's the word? Oishi desu. Oishi desu. Oishi desu is it's tasty in Japanese. Oh, is it like battered steak in a sandwich? Yum. Mmm. It's just like a bacon sandwich. It is a bit like a steak. It is actually like a bacon sandwich, but like with steak. Oh, ketchup on it, I think. Mmm. Oh, yeah, I'll have some more of that. Tasty. So we've come to this place called... Well, it's not really got a name. Fruit mixed juice with some sort of cream on top. Oh, it's got ice cream on top of it. Oh, it's juice with ice cream on top. Billiken mini castella. It looks like the fishes that you get. Just squidgy ones, they've got like cream inside. They look like that, but in a shape of a... In the shape of a baby. No, a Buddha. Bu Buddha? Is it a Buddha? <laughs> <laughs> we don't know what it is. Oh, they're really cute. Look how small they are. The tiny gun. Hello. Look. This one, please. Okay. They're so small. Yeah. Oh, you get a little bag. Oh, a little bag. Thank you. Oh, that's cute. I thought it had cream inside, but it doesn't. It's a bit, oh, it's a bit bland, isn't it? I don't recommend that. It's not really. Uh, no. No, they should put cream or something inside it. We're just going around Osaka trying different food. Just came across the place where you actually fish for your own food. That, I've never seen that. You actually fish in the restaurant, catch it, and then they cook it. Oh, a little boat there, yeah. A little boat? Well, let me have a look. This is crazy. 
there's a boat in there and you fish for your own food and then when you catch a fish you give it to them and they cook it. It's just like something I've never seen ever anywhere before. We're exploring the Shinzekai area, by the way. We're still in that same area. We just come to another place. We've no idea what the food is, but it's like some sort of balls that they're like frying. It's got a picture of an octopus up there, so maybe it's octopus, I don't know. Anyway, we're gonna try it. So we just saw them putting bits of octopus in it. Yeah, okay, I won't tell him. It's like, um, it's pork. It's octopus tentacles. What is it? Cork balls, I think. I don't know why I'm laughing. I don't want to have it myself. <laughs> Harry, you ready? Come on, Harry. Is it actually pork? It actually is pork, yeah. Harry, you have one with me. Cheers. I'm not sure if I want to eat this, to be honest. Look inside it. Oh, oh, oh. oh, oh. oh, oh. Don't spit it out. Don't spit it out. Oh, what? No, move it oh, around. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, oh. oh, what? I don't like that at all. That's rank. So, that was an absolute no from me. It's funny because I was taking the mick out of Harry and then I didn't eat it myself. <laughs> and Harry actually yeah. ate it. In that... I liked it. You actually like it? Yeah. Well, how come you didn't have any more then? I'm not hungry. Oh, because you're not hungry. <laughs> Oh yeah. So Dan just described Osaka, or at least the area that we're in right now, Chenziku. Ziki? He said it's a bit like a seaside town, but without the sea. A lot of arcades, there's a lot of um, games and stuff in the shops. You know like where you like throw things into like the, the hoops and you, you win a prize? There's a lot of stuff like that as well. And there's actually not as many tourists here as there was in Kyoto, which I'm actually surprised about. One's cheese and one's custard. I've got the cheese one. Oh! Like Same, the outside's not that good, is it? It's just the inside bit. Too the much. 500 yen each. I must say, the cheese doesn't really taste of anything. It's really stringy and everything. But it doesn't really have like any taste. It's really weird. It's like, I've never had cheese that doesn't really taste of anything at all. It's really odd. This is a custard one now. It's quite tasty, actually. Mmm. It's only right in the middle, isn't it? Yeah, it's right in the middle. It's not on the edges. The custard one's nicer, I think. The custard one, in my opinion, was a lot better than the cheese one. Still, go on and try it because it's like something that everyone talks about on TikTok and everything now. Right, it's very busy here. This is in the Namba area, near Namba Station. It's so busy. We're near Namba Station, but the area is called Dotonbori. Dotonbori. It's the busiest area we've been in in Osaka by far. Off the main street, there's a few side streets, and we found a restaurant on Google that does the traditional okonomiyaki. So we're going to try that in this restaurant. We're just looking for the restaurant now on Google Maps. It's called Hosen, Ho Hoisenjai Sanpi. There's a queue to get in. Wherever we go, we're gonna have to queue up, so. It shuts at 11, so it's nine o'clock now. We've been in the queue for about half an hour so far, so it better be the best food I've ever had in my life. Okay, 40 minutes later, we're here. 40 minutes. First time trying sake. Okay, so a trip in Japan wouldn't be complete without trying chilled sake. Me and Harry both got a bottle each. Chilled sake. Uh, let's give this a go. Oh no. It's quite nice. It goes down smoothly. Chilled sake. Wow. It feels like it's alcohol and they forgot to put the mixer in. Is that pure alcohol? Where's the, where's the mixer? It needs lemonade or something like that. Asahi. Uh, round two. Yeah. Round one, yeah. Yeah. Nice. Not as good as Guinness. Is it not? No. What do you think, Dan? Yeah, it's nice. I like that. Drink. What is the drink? I think I'll give up. Okay. This is plum wine soda. Oh, that's more like it. Mm. That's nice. Try that. Let's try this. Drink. Very tasty. It's like a soda with alcohol in it. It's really nice. Oh yeah, that looks banging. Smells good as well. Nice good. Chicken, bean sprouts. We got some rice on the side, and it's got ponzu sauce on it, which is like a soy sauce. That's really nice, guys. Oh, yeah. good. 
Where'd it go? Food, I mean, last soda. Last soda. Oh, for okay. food. Oh, oh. No, we're okay, I think, for food, are we? I think so, yeah. yeah. Very tasty. Mm. The other oh. side, yeah. Ginger, yeah. It's kimchi. The red one. Kimchi. Kimchi is horrible. Do you like it? Trying it now. This kimchi is actually very good. Do you like kimchi? Mm. It might be nicer here than it is back home. Mm. <laughs> Oh, no, it's not. We have some yakisoba, which is noodles, with beef tenderloin. The chicken with ponzu sauce was so good. Highly recommend that. We all really like that. They're all like literally getting the scraps. It's that good. These noodles are really good, by the way. Yakisoba. Oh, oh wow. Wow. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. Wow. Thank you. So this is the traditional okonomiyaki. <laughs> okonomiyaki. <laughs> yeah. It's the traditional pancake. But it's not like a pancake like you get with like cream and all that. It's a savoury one. Oh, look, it's got an egg in it and beef and stuff like that. This is what it looks like. I don't even know what it is. I'm actually not even sure. Oh, it's a lot of flavour in that. It's really saucy. Soy sauce type thing, you've got like a mayonnaise kind of sauce it's with all these sauces, it's very, very saucy. Quite tasty, isn't it? Uh -huh. Like it? Good. Yeah, quite tasty. Have you tried the noodles yet, Harry? Sorry, guys. We've just come to um, an observation deck. To certain Keiku. Also, it shuts in like 15 minutes, so we're really late. It shuts at half seven. It says on Google it shuts at eight. Don't believe that, it's half seven. 2,700 for three people. Just bumped into Erin. Um, we met her in Tokyo at the bar crawl, and then we just bumped into an Osaka. <laughs> She was just walking along the street. We, we just met. Yeah. <laughs> so random. I don't know where we are now. Second parasol here. Ah. So, wait, so, wait, he goes upside down. An unusual goes... fake one. You're rotating your little thingy. No, I don't think so. <laughs> it's like a really weird Ferris wheel, but it's like, no. it looks like a roller coaster. It's so weird. We're going to head to a karaoke room now. Rainbow karaoke. Thank you. So we're heading into the booth with our lovely guide. Yeah. Hey. What's your name? Uh, I'm Koske. Koske. Yes, yes. Koske. 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 Room 410. Here we are. Oh, it's hot. That is the end of this video. Don't forget to hit subscribe. I'll see you next time.